6. Are you available? Copy. 240 negative? Sorry. False alarm on that code red near Magnolia. Try that crumpet shop off Post Alley. Thanks, 303. Copy. Dispatch, I need to run a license check on that 10. Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup available. Hey, it's gonna be alright. On the ground. Tonight, don't be late, losers. Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well... The suspense is killing me. It's dad. He wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So. So what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself.
Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. <sighs> Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Yeah, okay. It's Friday. Thanks for making me smoke again. Oh, then I'll make sure you don't smoke any weed tonight. Deal? <laughs> Deal. <laughs> Can't wait to see you baked as hell trying to pull this off. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa! What the hell are don't you doing? Don't move! You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All oh, right, blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D O. Oh, stop! You're out of room, punk. Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> you wish. Oh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. I should change us so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey! No fair. Shh, shh, shh. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, 
You have to earn it, your honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week. Or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad, dad, dad. What is this? Mm. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. He sucks. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Yeah, I have to work in my room too. Yeah, don't hurry back. Okay, let's get this party list started. It's good to be the judge. That's right. Que pendejo. It's nice going jogging with Dad every once in a while. Though he's way too chatty. Better pack for the party.
I'm not that into cars, but these are pretty bitching. Dad hates sushi, but he orders it anyway for us. What if Jen came over? Mm, we can build a fire and... <sighs> Dude, stop. I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but... <laughs> not tonight. I don't know who plays more. Daniel or Dad. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. Geez, how old is this? We've had it since I was 10. Man, is there any more boring sport than baseball? <laughs> but you do you, Dad. Can't wait for the rain. Makes me feel like drawing. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. That's cool. Do not enter. Ever. <sighs> Trust me, Dad. I won't. I need to take care of that party list. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course. He asked Daniel, too. Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. How long is he gonna keep all this shit? Dad should just sell that other bike. That you, Choco Thief? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. <sighs> Jeez, that was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi, friend. How's this leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey. I got it. I think. Hmm. Wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Callow is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. 
prejudiced against Hey, seriously. What's taking you so long? Hey, seriously. I'm not a mechanic. Come on. Bring me anything, really. I'll tell you if it's the right one. Is that it? Yes! This is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And... you happy with it? I mean, your job? Living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico. To Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Mmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Ugh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha. I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? <sighs> ah, 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 ah. Shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Uh, come on. I wouldn't spend money on booze. We just want to get some, uh, some Halloween crap and stuff. Well, then you definitely don't need the $40 I was going to give you. Twenty bucks? That's it? You can buy a lot of Halloween crap and stuff for twenty bucks. Unless you're lying your ass off. Remember, no eating candy and driving. You got it? Tell Lila too. You hear me? <sighs> yes, sir. Yeesh. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay, have fun, but not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood, even though he won't tell. I would be fucked if I had to help Dad in the shop. Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. It'll be weird having my own car. But then I could take Jen out, if she wants. Dad is actually kind of a secret geek. Maybe a nerd. Dad used to go see them all the time. 
can all people be cool? Real funny, Dad. Meet the Diaz. Organization experts. Yo, cookies. You're coming with me. Gotta bring some munchies. Maybe this is better. Dad is like a big kid. He gets so hyped for Halloween. Cross that off the list. Food down, drinks to go. What the? Is Dad baking something? Yo, that secret recipe fucking rules, actually. <laughs> Daniel kept saying, I'm freezing, but we couldn't get him off the skis. could live off this crap. That'll do. Bet there's gonna be a keg at the cabin. Don't forget the non-booze. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. He was so proud to get that. He should be. Will Dad actually take us there one day? <laughs> Doubt it. Damn. The guy never stops working. <laughs> At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. Well, it's not my turn to do the laundry. Hey, Jen. What's up? Oh, try again, loser. Hey, you look totally hot. Oh my god, stop. Oh. Hey. You wanna share my blanket? Hey, Jen. Do you wanna hang out sometime? Not bad. Remember, don't be too thirsty. Daniel better not use my toothbrush again. We almost got caught by a crazy old dude, but it was such a blast. Asshole. This was such a cool day. Can't wait to go back out there with the crew. Man, I so don't want to work this weekend. Very funny, Lila. 
Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. Eric got us some purple last month. It was fucking insane. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. My first hangover. Dad laughed at me so hard when I came back home. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want... Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. Damn. I still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. We got these for free during sex ed last year. Oh, hi, Gunther. Sorry. You stay hidden here. We got these for free during sex ed last year. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it looks pretty rad. <laughs> Lila was belting out so hard during that show. She lost her voice for a week. I think I know what to ask for Christmas. Lila will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. The lighting is nice. It's been a while since I've sketched my room. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. My room almost looks cool on this. Not an easy task. <laughs> good job. told them not to take a picture of me after the race. <laughs> I look like a sweaty pig. I'll never make varsity at this rate. Thanks, Daniel. I'll, uh, treasure this gift always. I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. That would be sick to just go tag the world. Tat would cut my arm off if I got a tat like that. But when I turn 18... Couldn't live without this shit. Time to get in the mood for tonight.
How many times have I watched it? Not enough. Come on, open up. Why? <clears throat> because. Okay, okay. <sighs> what are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You ate my choco Chris. <sighs> Don't be pissed. You always eat the whole box. What's with the sisters? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Oh, man. Damn, sounds pretty serious. Should I call an ambulance now before it's too late? Maybe. <laughs> All I can say is, watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is gonna be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. Did she ask about me? Yes, she wants to marry you. Shut up! Aunt, I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. Daniel's always up to something. Wonder what's next. Finally ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Lower boy, just give me a minute. Ooh, good tune. Getting in the mood for tonight, huh? <laughs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so we're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else, ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? Well, I don't know. Play it cool, talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh, oh my god. You did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. So what? I don't have any game. These are uncharted territories for me. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean, into you. Sean, I'm done, look. I made zombie blood. It's um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey, hi <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just- Come on, man. Just uh, Just bugging the uh, shit out of what? me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, but... I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <gasps> but- I wanna see zombie blood if you don't. He's not always cute. You would sound like me too if you lived with him. Anyway. You wouldn't be so uptight if you got laid. And maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? 
I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Ooh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Let me see that drawing. This might be my masterpiece. Not taking a look at her picture? Well, yeah. It's my portrait. Not taking a look at her picture? Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh. You will see. <laughs> I see you, Sean. Should we set the wedding date now? Hey, come on. It's just a heart. I like her hair, okay? No big deal. Sure. <sighs> Why is... Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Uh, uh, hey. Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz! He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt! Look! I told you, it was an accident! You better leave us alone! Oh yeah, go hide in your dad's garage! Pussies! You think you own the block? Step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <sighs> You and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! What? What's going Fuck on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! <laughs> on the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating me. up my little brother. Now, hands behind your Sean. head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? Get on the ground, sir. Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. Oh, Sean, listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. I go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's gonna be all right. On the ground.
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being... being at home or... or in your room. This is a... a real adventure. Right? So... Come on, let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I'm so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey. At least we don't have to go to school on Monday. Right? Yeah. Look! Um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome possum. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We could be wolves. Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I, I tag your ass and no. run. You're it. No way, not fair. Whatever. Okay, I'm a zombie. And I'm gonna eat you! Blah!
Are we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that. Ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry, too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. and around watching I us. see something. What is that? What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky choco crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love choco crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please Get one when we stop next, please. I promise. Yeah! And you can wash it down with a frosty root beer later, okay? But I'm starving. Just don't eat me. Now we can see where we are. Whew, there's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No, duh. It's way too cold for a skinny butt. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be fine. I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us? And they're hunters. You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Daniel, check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze. And people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. If only that showed me how to read. Stop thinking about that. Get over yourself. I hope we don't get lost. <sighs> how? No reception in the shithole. Like anybody's gonna pay in the middle of nowhere. Come on, Daniel. The sun is going down. Man, people don't even read the signs. I haven't seen one of these for miles. <sighs> okay, dude. You have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh, well, maybe I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. Ugh. Yuck. This is disgusting. So gross. These are worse than the ones
things at school. <laughs> Especially after you use it. Pretty deep, Picasso. Hey. I thought we were going to camp. Sean? It's getting dark. Sean? Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they uh, attack us? Hey, you watched Lord of the Rings with Dad like a hundred times. Here's a chance to go on a real adventure with me. Mm. So I'm like Frodo and you're Sam? Uh, <laughs> well, I was thinking more like Aragorn. You know, brave, strong, good looking. <laughs> no way, Jose. You're Sam. Sam. And we have to find a secret cave so we can hide from the orcs. <sighs> okay, okay. Sam, I am. After you, Master Daniel. Dad always knew exactly where to go. What does that he was a living say? compass. It says to go right. Whoa. That place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Where are we going? Man, what are we doing out here? Huh. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. I don't think Daniel understands what's going on. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. I don't know how I still remember these. Oh, this one looks like a Tetris block. Sean, let's play hide and seek. Bet you can't find me. No, not right now. We stick together. Ah, uh, you're no fun. Not today, I'm not. Sorry. Whatever. Daniel, come check this out. What? What? Be quiet. He'll take off. Ooh. Raccoon! He's so cute! <laughs> that raccoon will tear us apart. Let's go, bro. Here, kitty kitty! Here, kitty kitty! Aw, that raccoon must be starving. Raccoons are way smarter than us. He'll find more food. came with us. He could be our pet. Oh, man, raccoons are not a pet. You ever see their claws? Yeah, but this one likes me. Until you run out of food. Let it go, Daniel. That showed me how to read these when I was eight. Ooh, I bet the ants are out here. I don't think ants can move those rocks. <sighs> the ants, not ants. From Lord of the Rings. Jeez. I do not want to get stuck out here. We gotta find a campsite.
Sean, look, look. I discovered a secret path. Coming. should have helped him. So much for the big bro. Oh, man. You okay? No. I don't like this place. I don't want to stay here. I know, Daniel. I get it. But we won't be here long. I promise. Sean. I'm tired. Do we have to keep walking? <sighs> No. I'm tired too. Plus the sun is going down, so... We better find our camping spot for the night. Is that cool with you? I'd be such a shit father. Come on, Sean Wise. We must explore. Hey, Daniel, you hear that? Is that a bird's nest? Oh, yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. Come on. We're too big for a nest. Got you. <clears throat> Phew, thanks. Uh, you see that? Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Uh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. What the hell is that? I should have listened in biology class. Daniel! <sighs> I got you! Dude, you struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! Uh, I saw your face. That was, uh, surprise. Maybe you scare me for like one second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie. like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there? I don't know. <sighs> Come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm, I bet we could stop any orts from capturing us in here. Cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. 
Yes! Uh, so what do we need? I need you to build a fort to keep out orcs, trolls, uh, everything. And I'll take care of finding the wood. Deal? Yes! I can build traps, too. Nothing will get to us. Awesome, dude. I know. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming! Let's see. Here's a good spot. One step here, and... Now this is perfect. This is gonna be 100% orc proof. We can't fortify without weapons. and dry. Uh -huh. Holy shit. That went to the ER after he got stung. Now we don't have that option. Hmm. That's enough for a toasty fire. I guess Daniel can chill a little. Hey, can you give me a hand? Yeah. This is the best. Yo, what are you doing? I'm trying to move this branch to protect the base. Good call. Here, let me take this side. You got it? We'll see. Go ahead and push. get in here now. Damn right. Nice work, Daniel. Cool. I'll go check the river. We're doing okay together. Nineteen eighty six? Damn that's ancient.
Now that's a fort. Good work, little bro. Check this out, Sean. Whoa. Nice view. You can see so far. Wait, I'm coming. He's such a little guy, but he's dang strong. Amazing, huh? See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? Don't know. Cotton candy? That's it? Cotton candy? I don't know. What do you see? A dragon. What? Where? Okay. There's the tail. And the horns. And the fangs and the smoke coming out of its mouth. Oh, I see it. It's awesome. 